All right, everybody. So I just got this new water flosser in the mail just yesterday. And I got to tell you, it is the best flossing I've ever had using this. Because the cool thing about this is that it's got two settings. It's got a low setting for for sensitive teeth like, like how I have. And then a high setting for deep cleaning. And I use them on both settings. And this thing... Works really well. In fact, this is the on-off switch right here. Yeah. Sorry, I gotta turn it on. Look at how quiet that sounds. It's got an easy fillable tank right here, which you can fill it up with warm water. And then it comes with four tips, which this is one of the tips I have on. The other three tips are right here. Some come with only two tips. Some models come with a bunch of them. And then you got this charger right here, which is pretty cool. And just like you would with traditional floss, this you should use once a day, like your dentist says. And speaking of dental, and speaking of floss, here's the elephant in the room, the culprit. S traditional fucking spring string dental floss. And I'm sorry, Glide, and to all companies that make this, but this is terrible. In fact, string floss is just as terrible as a traditional toothbrush. Because as I stated in my previous video I just made of me at CVS ranting about these, as well as traditional toothbrushes, but these make your gums, make it uncomfortable. And this does not deep clean as well as this water flosser right here. This leaves you with uncomfortable flossing experience as well as, um, what else do you call it? Sore, bleeding, and excess on the gums. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to all the dentists who use this on their patients as well as people who use this, but do not buy this. This is fucking garbage. This is the real deal right here. Go for this water flosser. It is amazing. You'll have a pain-free flossing, and just like with the Brevi toothbrush video I did, this will do you justice. This right here will do you justice, and the cool thing is, this water flosser actually rotates this thing so you can change the angles as you go move along with this in your mouth. Takes a little time to get used to though because of the vibration, but this is worth the money. This, on the other hand, is not worth the money. In fact, just like with the traditional toothbrush and my other and my video on why you should buy the Brevi toothbrush, this I will I will now do the honors of throwing this in the garbage because. This right here is a piece of garbage. Yeah, rod in pieces, you fucking string floss, as well as freaking traditional toothbrushes. This thing, though, will give you less cavities, just like with the Brevi toothbrush. Because a traditional toothbrush, as well as string floss and dental picks, or floss picks, whatever you want to call them, it's actually the same thing. On a side note there. Does not deep clean your teeth. It just it just makes it just makes it worse. And it doesn't just leave you with sore and bleeding gums as well as excess on the gums. It also gives you bad breath. Unexplainable bad breath. And I've been having this issue for years because of years of using traditional toothbrushes and strength floss. In fact, that's why I've gotten so many cavities over the years. And no to that dental assistant I saw a few weeks ago. I did I do not have excess on the gums from not brushing or brushing or flossing regularly. No. I brush and floss regularly. That's only happened as well as the six cavities I've gotten because of years of using stupid traditional toothbrushes and fucking traditional string floss. Yeah, I'm sorry to the companies who make those, but your two, your traditional toothbrushes and dental floss are terrible. They're freaking garbage. Blah. Just garbage. Go for this and the Brevi toothbrush. It's the real deal. Because you'll have a more smooth and comfortable brushing and flossing and pain-free. And then just like with the Brevi toothbrush, this will also massage and deep clean your gums. And it will access areas of your mouth 
just like the Brevi toothbrush does, that a traditional toothbrush and dental floss cannot do. So, yeah. Just thought I'd make this video and explaining why you should go for this and not string floss. And then this tip right here, um, it's actually got a nice brush on it. This is one of the four tips it comes with. This one also has a brush on it, which is nice. I can't remember off the top of my head what these two tips are called, but um, one is called Orthodontist. One is, um, this one's the Orthodontist. This one, I believe, is the plaque corrector. And then these two are just the general cleaning ones, which look really nice. This is definitely worth the buy because because then you'll have um, a more comfortable experience brushing and flossing. In fact, another thing you should also go for um, is if you want to is the um, flouse. It's an electric. It basically looks like a floss pick. Difference is though, it's it's electric. It's not like a cheap hunk of plastic like the floss picks are. That one is is an electric one. It's basically an electric toothbrush, but with but a but with dental floss. Go for that one as well. And then also go for the cocoa floss. It's basically like string floss, but the different it's but it's made of a different type of fabric. It's not that thick white dental floss that you see in stores as well as dentists use. It's um it's pretty much like a rubber band, pretty much. That's what it is. So yeah, so go for go for the water flosser and whatever new and improved item has been released out there, as well as the Brevi toothbrush and all the other new and improved toothbrushes. Do not buy traditional one toothbrushes as well as string floss and dental picks. Those are garbage.